Harry enjoyed the breakneck journey down to the Weasley's Bolt, but felt dreadful when it was opened. There was a very small pile of silver sickles inside, and just one gold galleon. Hello, guys! Welcome back to my channel. We all know that the Weasley family is poor, but do you know why they are poor? In this video, we are going to analyze why the Weasley family is so poor. So watch the video till the end. So without further ado, let's get started. Weasleys have the biggest heart. But there has been one problem which has been bothering them through the entirety of seven books, which is poverty. There are many reasons why Weasleys are poor. So let's discuss them. The biggest reason why the Weasleys are poor is that Arthur and Molly had seven children. This is because Molly wanted a girl, and they had six boy, and Ginny was their seventh child. So they had a total of seven children. They had to buy robes and books and wands and all other Hogwarts stuff for seven children. This was not easy for them. A huge chunk of what Arthur earned was used up in buying Hogwarts stuff for all seven children. Another important factor is that Arthur was not ambitious. He worked in the misuse of Muggle Artifacts office, which had only two people, Perkins and Arthur. So the office never got much funding as most of the people in higher positions were pure blood, which did not like muggle related, related stuff a lot. So this department never got much funding and therefore Arthur never got a pay raise in the entirety of his job in the Ministry of Magic. He never left his job, although he was clever and skilled enough to get a better and more deserving job but he never left his job because he loved what he do what he did and he loved to know he loved to learn more about muggles so he continued doing what he did he was happy with what he had and was never too ambitious to get more money this resulted in his family suffering to poverty another contributing factor too is that Molly was a housewife and not a working woman, so she could not contribute to the finances of the house. Most of the people say that Molly had to be a housewife because they had seven children to whom care need to be given and But what I believe is that no, Molly should not have been a housewife because all the seven children go to Hogwarts for almost the year. They come only for the summer breaks. So she could have worked and Arthur also works. So no one was in the house and she did not have to care for anyone during most of the year. So she could have worked in the Ministry of Magic with Arthur, but she didn't. And this is what J.K. Rowling decides. So I can't say anything more, but I believe that Molly should have worked because Weasleys were poor and more income need to be generated. So Molly should have worked, but it's okay. She did not work. And this also contributed to their poverty and all these factors contributed together to their poverty. That's it for this video. If you enjoyed watching the video, then give it a like. If you don't want Ron's here to go ping out of embarrassment of poverty, then subscribe to my channel. I will be posting lots and tons of videos on Harry Potter, which I am sure you are going to love. So subscribe to my channel and yes, also um, turn on the notifications by clicking on the bell icon and turning on always so that you get notification whenever I post future videos and you get tuned. I will be posting a video every Sunday, which is every weekend. And that's it for this video. Bye-bye. I will meet you in my next video.